Gamma 1 and Gamma 2 have been revealed. Their promotional video has come out for both Dokkan Battle Global as well as JP, which is pretty cool. Another simultaneous mini celebration. I don't think it's going to be like a huge ordeal, but with Gamma 1 and Gamma 2 coming, they could come as free to play or summonable. We don't know quite yet. We don't know those details. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think, how they will make their appearance, whether it will be summonable or free to play. With this reveal, there are a couple of thoughts that I have. Since they're coming out on both Global and JP, they are movie related. You know, on JP, this is going Goku right here this path to power Goku was released and I made a video on this path to power Goku and in that video I stated that we might very well see a DB saga themed anniversary since this came out but he's also related to movies and now we're getting a gamma one and gamma two on both global and jp and they are movie related Th this could go both ways we could still get a db saga themed anniversary but with gamma one and gamma two coming out so close to jp's anniversary and the fact that they're coming to both versions leads me to believe and this is complete speculation 110 percent speculation i have no confirmed details there's no sources that i've looked at to share these thoughts with you is completely on me so take this with a grain of salt i'm not saying that this is what it is going to be but looks like it could definitely lean heavily towards a superhero themed anniversary and as we know in the producer video or letter producer letter or video i can't remember what it's called but it was on the jp side and they did a video stating that the eighth anniversary is going to be about units that have never been anniversary units in the past it still could be db saga themed because we've never had a db saga character as an anniversary unit it could still be a superhero themed celebration because obviously with superhero being so new those characters would be completely new anniversary units and new overall in the game as well that is one thing that i think you know could be the outcome of these two really cool characters releasing on both versions of the game now the other thought i have is about this story event path to ultimate power gohan and piccolo where you recruit this agl gohan from dragon ball super superhero and as of the moment he does not have a doke on awakening with gamma one and gamma two releasing on both versions the fact that we're getting their promotional video what was it yesterday and we got their teaser on thursday the 6th we could very well see their actual release being on the between like the 19th and the 22nd because usually when leaks and stuff like this happen it happens a week and a half two weeks before they actually release now it could be different this this based on habits of dokkan so it could very well be different but as of right now making an educated guess those are the dates i would say they would release in between those dates the fact that this story event says path to ultimate empower gohan and piccolo there's one of two things that could come about that so this gohan still needs a dokkan awakening we could see this gohan being dokkan awakened into a super saiyan gohan or a super saiyan 2 gohan or even possibly a, an ultimate Gohan. Now, a lot of people have been saying and probably want a free-to-play LR ultimate Gohan. While I think that is possible, to be honest, I don't think it would respect the ultimate Gohan form to have it be a free-to-play LR first. I really feel like it should be a summonable LR first, but if that's the case, I mean, I think it's possible, but I don't think it's very possible at the moment. So he could Dokkan Awaken into a Super Saiyan Gohan, or Super Saiyan 2 Gohan and then Dokkan Awaken into an LR Ultimate Gohan. But then he could also Dokkan Awaken into a Ultimate Gohan and Ultimate Piccolo duo unit. Very possible right there too because they do fight together. So that's another option as well. Or you could just Dokkan Awaken into a Super Saiyan Gohan or a Super Saiyan 2 Gohan and then we could get more stages added to this story event. We would actually get more stages added to the story event for the Dokkan Awakening of this Gohan anyway, but even more stages added for a separate Piccolo, a free to play Piccolo unit added to this story event. Now that could be an option as well because it does say Path to Ultimate.
ultimate power gohan and piccolo so i think that's very possible and some really viable options as far as adding some more story events and adding some more assets to this story for us to grind something i would like to see on a side note is a free-to-play pan i would love to see a free-to-play pan that would be freaking awesome from this movie so let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below what do you think about this celebration what do you think it's going to bring to dokkan as far as the celebration itself and possibly in the future with the anniversary and any future events with relating to dragon ball superhero i would love to hear from you guys we are on our way to 750 subs and we need your help to get there before the end of november so if you're enjoying the content please consider hitting that red subscribe button liking the video and setting your bell to all notifications so you can receive all notifications to my videos thanks for watching i appreciate y'all until next time